Right, this is my review of the K2 Rival Pro Snowboard Ski Helmet 2013 Edition. I just picked it up the other day and took it out for the first time today. It was up at Keystone. Great day, super cold, but about 7 8 inches of powder it was perfect. Um, pretty much this helmet, I bought it because of how light it was. This thing weighs uh, 394 grams. So literally weighs nothing. Um, it's made out of polycarbonate uh, shell. It has the, uh, what do you call it, EPS inside there. So, yeah, great helmet. Comes with a, the pro version comes with the built audio. So pretty much in the box you're going to get the helmet and then they give you this little bag has two little pads and somewhere I got here it is the uh, audio cable the audio cable that comes with it basic volume with the push on and off piece of shit just throw that in the trash it's ridiculous you pay thirty bucks for a helmet and they give you the shittiest audio uh, <laughs> the shittiest audio cable. The thing crackles. It makes it so only one speaker worked right out of the box to begin with. So I just um, used my... I have a Beats by Dre headset. Those are also pieces of shit. But the audio cable they use is actually really good. So I just took the audio cable off that. That has the same thing. Volume up and down. And a pause button. Works perfect with the iPod. So that plugs in right back here. The bottom left, you got your speakers. Very loud speakers, actually. Um, I was riding with a friend, so I was talking most of the day. So I just had it, you know, half halfway, the volume half up, and it's perfect. You can talk to people while you're listening to your music while you ride. Um, yeah, very basic helmet, just a very nice liner inside super warm I mean it was like zero degrees up there with it was probably in the negatives with the wind chill so I didn't wear a beanie or anything under it and was super warm um, it has a quick adjuster here I'm medium I just wear it all the way out but if you have a small head or you get a large or something and you wanna crimp that in that works fine this is all detachable washable uh, the speakers just pop out. This helmet, and I couldn't find a review anywhere on YouTube for it, but it's it's a it's an interesting helmet just because of the um, polycarbonate uh, surface on the top here. It seems like it's it feels like styrofoam almost. So it's not like a a burn helmet, which is like super you know hard plastic or whatever. So it probably will dent fairly easy, but I try not to <laughs> hit my head on anything. So, I mean, if you take if you take a dive, obviously it's going to protect you. But it may be those helmets that only is good for like one big hit, and it might, you know, you might have to buy something new after that. But for you know, if you can get it for around 100 bucks, I got it for 120. But you can find it online for like 100 bucks. Uh, well worth me. Looks really sick. Nice, nice little air vents here. You know, kept me ventilated. So it just goes through, and it kind of um. There's little tracks up top, and then it runs out the back. Two places. Watching.